Hello everyone. Today we are going to balance this reaction. This is hydrochloric acid, this is calcium hydroxide and this is calcium chloride and this is water, right? Okay. To balance this reaction, we have to draw a table like this. On the left hand side or right hand side, we have one hydrogen here, we have two hydrogen here, right? And here we have one chlorine and here we have one calcium. Here we have two oxygen. Here we have two hydrogen. Here we have two chlorine. Here we have one calcium. And here we have one oxygen, right? Okay. Uh, to balance uh, hydrogen, uh, three, two is not easy. So let me first balance the number of chlorine. Here we have one. Here we have two. So balance this uh, chlorine. I can multiply here by two. That gives me two. These two will come before this chlorine that is here. So I will place here two, right? Two. Okay. If I place here two, the number of hydrogen will be two hydrogen here one times two, two hydrogen. So two plus two that gives me four, right? So I will write here four hydrogen. Okay. So our uh, chlorine 2,2 two, two is balanced, but now our oxygen here, calcium is balanced, but our here oxygen is not balanced. So let me balance the hydrogen first. It will be easier for us to do that. So if I multiply here by 2, that gives me 4. So hydrogen is balanced. If you multiply here by 2, these 2 will come before this hydrogen that is here, right? Okay, so now our hydrogen 4, 4 is balanced, our chlorine C2, 2, 2 is balanced, our calcium 1, 1 is balanced, and our oxygen here 2, here 1. Remember, if you multiply here by 2, then these 2 will come before this hydrogen that is here. If you put place here 2, the number of oxygen will be changed, that is, you will get. 2 times 1 that is 2 oxygen right so here you have to place here 2 2 right now look at the number of oxygen 2 to balance calcium balance chlorine balanced and hydrogen is balanced so overall this equation is balanced now okay I will show to balance this uh, equation uh, applying the second technique that that I have so you will be able to apply this technique in the examination hall. So let's get started. Okay, you can write, you can write water like this way, right? This is water, so you will be able to like this water like this way. H plus waste, right? Water equal to, water equal to H plus waste, right? Okay, so how to balance? Okay, this is a cell, right? A cell plus calcium hydroxide 2 plus 1 minus. So this uh, plus will go with this negative, right? So we are getting here calcium and chloride. Calcium here is 2 plus. To balance the plus and minus, I can put here 2. 2 plus, so we have to take 2 minus. That's why I'm giving here 2. If I put here 2, the number of chlorine will be 2. That This chlorine will come from this compound. That is, here I will put, here I will put here 2, right? Okay. So, <clears throat> and next thing. This, uh, this is this uh, hydrogen ion will go with this hydroxide ion, right? So I will get another product, H plus OH, right? Here we see, uh, here we have two OH. That means here I have to put here two. And then I will get two plus hydro hydrogen ion. And here already we have plus hydrogen ion so this reaction is 
balanced. So, okay, compare this equation, this is balanced. So, applying the second technique, you can balance the equation easily. So, thanks for viewing this video. Be well.